So, you know, just to me, like, I talked about busybodies in the last week and how I don't like busybodies, and it's really none of their business, and honestly, like, it's just funny, like, <clears throat> it's funny, like, he didn't do this, or, well, he didn't do that, and it's funny, it's like, it's like, there used to be years ago a commercial on, um, what was it? It was the um the Rob Lowe commercials. They're really like like funny, like the Rob Lowe lazy commercials, the Rob Lowe like the Rob Lowe like No, they were just the Rob Lowe like commercials like listening devices. Can they put listening devices in our cheese? It was literally funny. <laughs> oh my god. He didn't work twenty days in a row. Actually he did work twenty days in a row. Well, he didn't work 63 hours. Actually didn't work 63 hours. Well, he didn't do this. And that's funny. It's like, it's like, it gets back to me and amuses me. Or if it's like talking about me, it gets back to me. I don't feel like drawing it on and on about like somebody like, Somebody from another area, like, this is not what we're talking about. We're drawing about, like, about, like, Fort Mill. This is not what we're talking about, really. It's like... But, to me, like, I'm not going to sit there and say, Hey, getting that, like, Fort Mill's girl business. You know what I'm saying? I don't believe it's, like... But it's funny to me, like... They got listening devices. It's, like... It's funny that the funny thing about busy bodies is, like... If you sat something down right in front of them, <laughs> it would be amusing to me. Like, it just like, it's hilarious. Like, you know what I'm saying? It's like, I really worked 60, like 20 days in a row. I'm not lying, I really did. I mean, last week was like a low week for me. It was like 54, which is good to me, which is what I need. In fact, the next three days, I'll be wondering like what I'm gonna be doing, but. I'm gonna go like watch some movies and like go watch some SEC games, but what amuses me is like somebody I'm not even remotely interested in has a boyfriend that I'm never gonna be with. This is amusing me is that I'm not even talking about them. I'm an independent man. I got my own life. I'm looking for a better job right now. I'm looking for a townhouse. You can score all you want, but I mean. That's a logical, like, and, like, they'll be a logical, like, when you're talking about what you're saying. That's funny, but that's funny, like, so the ultimate busybody is the way to say it, like, is, like, <laughs> okay, it's funny that some of these, like, busybodies are paranoid, and they're judgmental. They think they're better than somebody else. That's the thing about big cities. You see big cities like people, even a decent size city like Charleston. Charleston and Concord are about the same size. So, like, I work in Concord, like, at Carvana, but, like, I, like, live in Charlotte. So, like, you see people busy about their day, really, not, like, nobody really cares. Like, you just got your own life. But, like, you now, like, in the same way in Charleston, it's a big city, a decent size city. It's, like, the same size as, like, Concord. Cogwood's bigger, about, about as big as any city in South Carolina, but, like, the thing is, is, like, you know in big cities that people are going to have their head up, they're walking, they're doing, they're doing something all their day, like, right now, even though I'm off, I want to, like, go apply for a better job, but it's just funny to me, it amuses me, like, when I'm sitting in a restaurant, everybody's, like, oh my god, uh, but whatever, anyways, um, yeah, um, it's like the ultimate busybody. I didn't know how many, I didn't know if he had a, <laughs> I don't think so, I'm not very well. Oh my god, this is hilarious. <laughs>